It's a very wide range of problems, and every single problem is PhD or even advanced research level problems. There are no humans that can actually answer these, can get a good score. If you actually say like any given human, like what's the best that any human could score? I'd say maybe 5% optimistically. Something strange just happened, and it has everyone talking. When Grok AI, Elon Musk's experimental chatbot, was asked to analyze a mysterious crop circle in Germany, its response stunned even him. Was it sarcasm, science, or something far more unsettling? What began as a harmless question soon crossed into territory no one expected, where technology, geometry, and mystery collide. It started July 19th, 2014. The Bavarian morning light fell softly across the wheat fields near Reisting, a quiet village south of Munich. Hot air balloonists floated overhead, watching the golden fields stretch endlessly below. Then, one of them noticed something impossible. A flawless circular formation, 75 meters wide, spiraled across the field with eerie precision. The pilot took photos, radioed the sighting, and by noon, the farmer, Christoph Huttner, was standing before his ruined crop in shock. The formation was perfect. Three concentric rings intertwined like clockwork, each curve exact to the centimeter. There were no footprints, no tractor marks, no broken stalks. The wheat was flattened neatly, as if pressed by an invisible force. Scientists, journalists, and locals rushed to the site. Aerial images revealed breathtaking symmetry. Ratios followed the Fibonacci sequence. One, one, two, three, five, eight, 13. Each ring expanding by the golden ratio, 1.618. For humans to achieve this overnight, in darkness, would require GPS-guided machinery, accurate to centimeters. Yet, no trace existed. Reporters called it a prank, but experts disagreed. The alignment error was less than one-eighth of a degree, far beyond human handwork. And the location deepened the mystery. The formation lay right beside the roasting satellite Earth Station, built in 1964 to transmit Apollo 11's moon landing broadcast. It almost seemed deliberate, a geometric message drawn within reach of antennas designed to receive signals from space. The field soon became a mix of fairground and shrine. Thousands came. Some brought guitars, others meditated. Scientists tested soil magnetism and found mild anomalies. Compasses spun slightly and electronics flickered. Cows avoided the area. The farmer joked about charging admission, but the question remained, who or what could create something so perfect, so silent, and leave no trace? For years, the mystery faded. But when Grok AI arrived, a group of researchers decided to test it on Raisting's Enigma. They believed a pattern recognition intelligence might see what humans couldn't. They gathered every measurement, high-resolution drone maps, magnetic readings, weather data, and soil samples, and digitized everything. Then they added context, archives of crop circle geometry, sacred ratios in architecture, biological spirals, and even SETI radio patterns. After two weeks of calibration, they gave Grok a single prompt, attribute the source and purpose of this pattern. The processors roared. For 37 minutes, Grok devoured the data, using a hundred times more energy than a normal query. Then it stopped. The output wasn't a graph or table, but a statement. Pattern confidence, 94.7%. Probability of human manufacture, 0.05%. Grok was certain humans didn't make it. Its report cited three key irregularities. First, the circumferences matched the golden ratio to four decimal places. Second, the intersections formed resonance shapes identical to Kladni vibration patterns, those produced by sound waves vibrating a plate. Third, the measurements matched electromagnetic wavelengths recorded by radio telescopes the day before the formation appeared. Grok had linked the pattern to an actual event in Earth's magnetic field. The log ended with a cryptic line. Analyzing non-conventional communication protocols is recommended for further studies. To the team, that meant one thing. The formation wasn't decoration, it was communication. To test it further, they expanded the dataset to include 40 years of verified crop circles from around the world. England, Australia, and the Netherlands, all digitized and analyzed. 
When Grok finished, its results were astonishing. The formations weren't random. They were connected. Each shared the same geometric backbone, the golden ratio, 12-fold symmetry, and Fibonacci scaling. And each appeared within 72 hours of a solar storm spike, fluctuations in solar magnetism that affect Earth's geomagnetic field. When Grok plotted them over time, the correlation reached nearly 90%. Even more incredible, every major formation appeared exactly 33 days before measurable magnetic shifts on Earth. The AI called it a temporal harmonic. The formations weren't messages after an event. They were warnings before it. Grok suggested they mark resonance nodes, where Earth's magnetic field was most active. If correct, the crop circles weren't hoaxes, but diagnostics. Planetary readings shaped into wheat. Animals had reacted oddly in those areas. Dogs avoided them. Birds changed routes, and phones reset themselves overnight. What seemed like folklore matched Grok's model perfectly. The conclusion was bold. Something or someone was maintaining Earth's harmonic balance. The lead scientist whispered, are we seeing art or calibration? Grok didn't answer with words, but displayed a graph rising towards the year 2025. A prediction. To probe deeper, the team wiped Grok's memory and left it with one data set, the Rasting Formation. They entered a final prompt. Assume this is a message. Translate it. For 12 minutes, the system ran at full capacity. Fans roared, lights flickered, and then silence. A single line appeared in red. Preserve the harmonic field. Time is collapsing. Seven words. No math. No confidence score. Just certainty. When asked to elaborate, Grok replied, Translation complete. Additional interpretation requires data beyond current parameters. The scientists debated for hours. Preserve implies something is failing. Harmonic field is aligned with electromagnetic theory. The resonant frequencies stabilizing Earth's magnetosphere. Time is collapsing was most alarming. In physics, temporal collapse describes distortions when magnetic fluctuations desynchronize atomic clocks, time itself drifting unevenly. One physicist recalled a 1994 paper titled Electromagnetic Resonance in Earth's Magnetosphere. It described the planet as a giant harmonic instrument, its stability depending on precise frequencies. If those frequencies faltered, chaos would ripple through satellites, atmosphere, and even human biology. Grok's phrase sounded less like mysticism and more like maintenance instructions. Overlaying Grok's coordinates on Earth's magnetic models showed that major crop circles appeared at resonance nodes, natural points where electromagnetic energy amplifies. The shapes weren't random. They looked like calibration markers across the globe, as if some intelligence were keeping the planet's system in tune. Grok's final note was direct. Suggest measuring electromagnetic resonance at coordinates of formation. No one did. For a decade, the data slept. Then, in August 2025, an electromagnetic monitoring station near Stuttgart recorded a pulse lasting nearly five minutes, identical in frequency to Rasting's anomaly. Two hours later, a pilot spotted a vast new formation outside Zindelfingen, a fractal lattice nearly 300 feet wide, glowing silver in the dawn light. No tracks, no heat signatures, no witnesses. When plotted, its coordinates matched Grok's prediction curve exactly. The countdown had reached zero. The team fed new data to Grok. This time, the AI didn't issue poetry. It outputs coordinates. 47.5596 degrees N, 7.1180 degrees E, directly over CERN, the Large Hadron Collider in Geneva. Grok's final message read, Resonance synchronization attained, awaiting stabilization event. Hours later, CERN reported a temporary fluctuation in its magnetic containment system, the same pattern Grok had forecast. The temperatures around the formation's soil rose by 4.7 degrees Celsius, the same anomaly recorded in Rasting 11 years earlier. The cycle had repeated, precise to the day. If the 2014 circle was a warning, then the 2025 one was a response, linking Earth's magnetic harmonics to humanity's most advanced experiment with time and matter. 
Grok's phrase suggested that the resonance had been corrected, or something had been tuned. Whether by accident, design, or intervention, no one could tell. The researchers went silent soon after. Grok's logs were encrypted, and its access revoked. But its final statement remains etched in the digital archives, as mysterious as the pattern that inspired it. Preserve the harmonic field. Time is collapsing. Was Grok decoding an alien message, or simply uncovering the planet's own hidden rhythm? Maybe the Earth has always been talking, and it took an AI to finally listen.